Okay. Sure. So, uh, combat's done. Guys, use recoveries if you need them. Uh, and then yep. continue on yeah, your journey. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to suggest meta and character wise that uh, I don't see a master here and uh, don't see any gnomes, so. Uh... We got to keep going. Yep. Yeah. And uh, the zombie form, whatever is left of that, dissipates. So, um, so right. Inferno. I only had four hit points three. left, but it served its purpose very well. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> I don't know if I'd thank you in character, you know, except for you know, just a little nod. Knowing what I know now, I guess I should have given it to the uh, the guy fighting in the back. Huh? Oh, well. <laughs> I definitely wasn't at 13 hit points or anything. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I was asking. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, you know, that's still almost half of my total HP, so I figured you'd be fine. <laughs> that was 13 out of 50, good sir. <laughs> All right. Well, oh boy! I guess there's more where this these came from. So, if, mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 maybe you got them all. Yeah, there's more. So, all right. Um, mm -hmm. yeah. uh, I I would I would have you guys roll a uh, um yeah roll a uh, terrain check. Tracking? tracking, 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 tracking. Sorry. Did you say rain check? Terrain. He said, said terrain. terrain. Oh, yeah. oh, I I just heard the rain check. I'm like, okay, take a rain check on your roll. <laughs> In call, <laughs> leave. Have you roll or... <laughs> All right. Um, you guys can't tell. <laughs> is it raining? At this point. Uh, One second. That's not uh, me. Oh, oh that's on. not you. That, that is not you. Heel. Okay. That's me. Okay. You can tell. Um, <laughs> 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 that uh, to your left is just a dead end. All right. So the, so there's no real dragging going on. There's just left. No, there's still end. dragging, but there was dragging to both sides. But like literally, if you move your character down just a little bit, you'll see that it's just a dead end. Like here, oh, so there was if down. there was dragging over here, does that mean that there's gnomes over here? Uh, no, there is nothing over here now. Okay, now. Yes, right. <laughs> at the moment. I guess the spiders are as clumsy as we are. Let's keep. I look, I look at. <laughs> By the way, I it should be perpetually assumed like people like bring like their staffs or equipment and things. One thing that my character perpetually does is check the ceiling. I never want to have to bring this up. I understand. <laughs> <laughs> Veteran adventure, waiting for the cloaker slash gelatinous cube to fall on my head, and then I die. Oh yeah. man, gelatinous cubes. Jesus. Oh, I I had a funny story with the gelatinous cube one time, but that will wait until after the session. You guys see a sign okay. on the wall that says "Welcome to the Tomb of Horrors." I am. Mm. Mm. All right. Um. So yeah, you guys can go to the right or up. I've been I've been through the Tomb of Horrors enough times. You fucking scrub lord, I'll win that. <laughs> hey, so is the scrub lord better or worse than the shit lord? I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm intrigued. <laughs> Look, Scrub Lord belongs in the check your privilege shit lord statement. Scrub Lord doesn't have anything to do with that. They're completely separate. It's like comparing oh. apples and oranges. Oh, okay. <laughs> or or as I'm now in my real life, I gotta be like, it's like comparing shit lords to scrub lords. Alright. Logic. Um, yeah. You guys you guys start to see light coming from a room. Hmm. Okay. You hmm. see you, like this you can all see that light, yes? But yeah, yeah. Orch light? Okay. I can see a fucking thing that I don't want to fucking see already. <laughs> yeah. Like, uh, oh, like, yeah, like, 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 see. like, like, what kind of light quality are we just, talking yeah. about? Here? Like a giant blazing bonfire. Yeah, we're oh. just gonna back well, the fuck up. Yeah, well, 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 what kind of air circulation do they have in here? That must be substandard. OSHA would not allow this. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> the, yeah. I don't know. So, um, you guys, you want to <laughs> stop before you come around the bend? Yes, of course. I want the spider bend. I yeah, because if we saw a giant fi a spider, I mean a fire, then we could. Colmore's going to just extinguish his torch. Mm -hmm. And no for those jerks. And he's going to take out his mirror. And he'll just push his, put his fingers to his mouth in a hushing motion, and he'll creep to this side of the wall. And then take out his mirror and try to peer around the corner and see what. What we can, what we might expect. All right. Um, what you see before you is a giant cavern. Uh huh. At the back of it is a giant bonfire. Um, mm -hmm. You see two large spiders and a few smaller spiders on the ground tending to several 
what almost look like sacks of webbing. And some of them are moving and some of them aren't. And there's about 20 or so of them there. And in front of them, you see something that you find absolutely revolting. It looks as though the lower part of its body is a spider. And the upper part of its body is a... Well, the best you can tell, maybe a female human or elf, but its skin is as black as the rest of the spider body. Mm -hmm. And um, that's what you see. Do you want to keep observing, or do you want to go back to the group? I'll observe for five more seconds, and right. then go back to the group. You hear um, the thing with the spider body and the female body ordering the other little spiders around, um, and you hear it say, quickly, pack them up. The mother will be pleased. Okay. Calamore will just quickly stand up, rush over to the rest of them, and whisper... A few more big spiders, a few small ones, and some sort of half person, half spider leader. They're packing them up. If we're going to attack them, we got to do it now. Did they say anything? Only mentioned about something about taking it off to, the, to a master, taking them off to the master. They have these sacks of webbing. I'm assuming it's gnomes. They said, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah uh, appear, uh, right? uh, Inferno, did you intend yeah. to say master because. They, I, no, they said something else. I meant so. mother. Mother, yeah. Oh, and, and in the case, no. in that, with the dim light that like, comes in, like Jarek's eyes, which are already widened due to the darkness, like perceptibly widened further. Yeah, son of a bitch. Because I was there too, so I would know this. Maybe it's a different mother? Uh, I highly doubt it. No. <laughs> Once again, ignorance is very blessed. While well, you guys are looking and it goes, what the fuck are you waiting for? We got to fight these things, right? Yep, Let's Cole's go. all ready for this. <laughs> yeah. Extinguishes yeah. his torch, of course, and then okay. continues. <laughs> Finn, oddly enough, is a little hesitant. <laughs> I wonder why. Uh, are you guys uh, charging in? Um, no. I would probably uh, okay. round the side um, in the darkness, knowing that the darkness is very much a friend. We'll probably just be peering over around the corner um, and... Um, We'll probably, uh, as as soon as he, he sees something that he can actually, uh, I guess he'll wait for a, a good opportunity, I guess. That would probably be the best way to put it. <laughs> All right. Um, give me a second. So you just you guys would just want to wait and see if there's a, a, a chance to attack. Surprise. Um, well, Colmore will suggest ranged attacks first, bring them towards us, and then we can engage them here rather than just running out into the open. As far as I'm worried, that's too far of a range for any of our ranged weapons to hit according to how yeah. 13th age mechanics yeah, work. Yeah, that's what I was about to say, is that you're, the closest thing to you from where you are is at least 100 feet. You're not going to be able to hit it with ranged, and, it's, and there's nothing in this cavern, so approaching it without them seeing you is very unlikely. You can attempt it and you might pull off some amazing rolls but there's nothing in between you and them and there's a giant bonfire fire lighting the whole cavern. One of us can go out and be like, hey over here and then they would come. Alright. Colomore says okay. Seems like a good enough plan. Jerry like waves his hand like, no, no. I got this. Maybe <laughs> Jerick will attempt what? to maybe this can trip will work. <laughs> uh, Jerick will attempt to cast ghost sound behind oh, this corner here, and we're gonna make it like the weak sound of like a mewling wood elf, like maybe like small like child, <laughs> like we'll say like boy, and it'd be like help me. <laughs> like a scraping of like a that claw, like a hand like against like the 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 floor, like he's trying to crawl. All right. That ghost sound. You want me to roll like my magic background and stuff for that? Because it's like a skill check. Because that's what ghost sound has a skill check. Sure, roll your yeah, sure. background. I mean, because you, you would do that before you actually find out if the spell works or not. So go ahead and do that. All right. All right. Um, funny thing about your cantrip, it works like a charm. Oh. All right. Well, that's good. That's not High funny. Five. <laughs> not yet. Not yet. Oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah. So, yeah, high five after <laughs> the fight. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, that's the sound that emits anyway. Okay, uh, oh. it, it emits a mewling, and um, yeah. the the creature lifts its head up and looks towards the sound, and and says, um, "Go find out what it is," and 
you see. Da, 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 da. Oh. oh shit! Just a second. While oh wait, while they're they're moving, right? Mm. <clears throat> I might do something a few seconds after I know that the ghost down happens, but continue describing your scene because colonel has got an idea. Uh, Alright, they start coming towards you. Um, okay. All of them. Uh, okay, I have... My goddamn bow. <laughs> hold up, hold up. Uh -huh. You guys might want to do something while I'm doing this. Am I good to interrupt you? Yes, you are. Alright, is going to take that helmet and he's going to oh! cast it right in the center here. Um, to be to 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 remind you how the helmet works, uh, you need to have thirty space, thirty feet. You do okay. You're yeah, good. I do. You're good. I just making it. sure, like, uh, uh, just a friendly reminder that it it, yeah, it suddenly appears, so it can't create thirty feet. But you're good. You're good. Yeah, I know. Well, fuck. Um. <laughs> da, 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 da. All right. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> yeah, they're not they're not rushing towards you, so they're just going to investigate the sound. So you've got. I am going it. to take a perch. <laughs> this reminds me of the situation in which we saw uh, the enemy who used this helm do that, and then they just we ran. They might run. <laughs> they're stupid spiders. We'll, we'll get a couple shots in at least. You said they wanted the to court. escape, so all right, go ahead and get inside the damn velvet thing. Oh my god, if this, is a, if this is a replay of that earlier game. Oh god. Well, don't give him any ideas. <laughs> <laughs> don't give the spiders The last ideas. thing the spiders were told were to go check it out. At the very least, a couple of them around the corner and we'll gack them. Alright, so we're just going to make a, a circle about like that. Actually, you know what? Let me make it bright. You can barely see that. <laughs> Alright, so we'll make My this old circle. lady eyes can't see that. Purple on brown and green. Great. Not like that. <laughs> um, these are your perches. I'm actually going to. Whoops, that, that's a horrible perch. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> there, I draw good. Oh. <laughs> it's like a really like loppy, upset face. <laughs> Blah. Blah. Alright, yeah. um, only one person can fit per perch. Okay. But you can also fit on top. You can top also go up on top, yeah. I'll and I'm go on guard top. The no, I can I'm... go on top. I'm on top. Oh. Too bad. Oh. Fuck, I wanted to be on top. <laughs> Fine, guys. Everyone, Everyone wants to be on top. top. <laughs> I'm going to be on top. There All we right, go. So okay. Let me hop on top. All right. So, uh, the spiders round the bend, and when they see your helmet, they give a squeal, a ch -ch 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 chittering sound, and, um,. They scream, they're here, they're here! And you hear everyone start rushing you. Roll for initiative. Yay! Please. Working, stupid spiders! You're so stupid right. and spidery. <laughs> oh, fuck. Hey, I got that wasn't, again. I got that wasn't again. my initiative. Uh, do you want me to keep the nine, or... Uh, wait. Cause I didn't yeah, 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 keep the, the nine, just add your modifiers okay. to it. God, what a um, horrible result for me. Ugh. Uh... <laughs> Good job, guys. Do. That's just. It, yeah, w once you get improved initiative now, Inferno, That's you're true. all full. Anything lower pissed. than 20 is disgraceful. I do agree. <laughs> all right, so the regular spiders have an initiative of 8. Not that great. I got, I got a below average roll. I have a plus 10 modifier okay. here. Oh my god. Uh, I'm just going to add myself to the initiative order, change the number to. I think it's still just 15. I think I might have. <sighs> Alright, um, okay, sorry, I was going to say the giant spiders and the little spiders have the same initiative, so I'm just going to have one little thing for the spiders. Spider. And this spider. guy, the spider, spider. spider, has an initiative of 28. <laughs> Get wrecked! Yeah, <laughs> fuck you, well, welcome to the Drider. 28 Club. Alright, uh, Keen, I'm sorry, uh, Cole, what does your initiative need to be? Uh, I think it is actually still 15. I think I've actually... Uh, that, right. I, I just didn't use the right in, uh, initiative button. Alrighty then. Uh, we'll put it all in descending order. Um, Pearson, what's your uh, dexterity? Uh, Plus 12. 14. No, okay, the drider's going to go first. Stupid drider. <laughs> okay, so... Um, Same initiative for me. <laughs> The drider is. Let's see here. Just being He's a bitch. Move up a little bit. 
And he is going to cast Easy. Lightning Bolt at uh -oh. Pearson. <laughs> Why me? Because you're right in the floor right there. Fine. <laughs> I, just, I love is, how I'm fighting this. This is versus <laughs> your uh, 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 you. physical. This is versus your physical defense. Oh, poopy. That's a twenty-nine. <laughs> All right. So he rolled an even. So he's going to cast another bolt of lightning at Keen. Out there on the perch. Okay. okay that's a twenty-five. He can roll another yep. even. So he's going to cast one at Finn. The fuck. <laughs> 18. 18 versus physical defense for Fen. So yeah. I believe those hit all of you. Yeah. 20 yep. points of damage. Oh uh, my god! Fuck oh, that! I'm using what? my belt! Christ. I'm using my belt! I'm using my belt, so okay. I'm negating that damage and taking a. Um, losing taking a recovery? A, we're losing a recovery. Jesus yeah. Christ! I'm not taking 20 fucking points of damage. Okay. I'm gonna need to see if my Rigo defense is working this battle. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> No, it no, doesn't. No, I'm gonna need an adult after this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. It's, uh, lightning hurts. It's a uh, lesson it's for just everyone. In. Lightning hurts. It's just in. Lightning that was def. Oh, God. I hope that was its daily. No, All right. Hello. It's just his normal attack. It's actually a minor, you know. Well, we're fucked. Oh, it's shit. a minor action for you. All right. Uh, Pearson, it's your turn. <laughs> Uh well I didn't I my my belt absorbed that mm -hmm. can't really do anything just yet and so all Colmore will do is raise his fists <laughs> and say shit in my <laughs> younger days I fucked prostitutes that were pretty ugly down on the black side but you take the cake honey and then that is that and that's it all right Finn. I'm okay. gonna use a recovery. <laughs> okay. Oh, so good. Yay! It's, yeah, that's actually pretty good. Yeah, right. it's not bad. Yeah. This is what I save the rest of the dailies for. <clears throat> All right, Derek. <laughs> All right, what the fuck is that? DL, <laughs> free action. The fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Jer Bear, kill him. <laughs> Jer Bear. No, no, Jer no. Bear. I think I should have read it in that? that. Use some weird necromancy there, shit. There, And attack. Wait, what? 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 He, I think he's doing like a magic or a spell. He wants to try to identify the dragon. No, I'm not trying oh. to do a magic. Show. I'm trying to look like, does Jerick know what that is? Uh, roll me uh, an intelligence check with your background. Yeah. Okay. With intelligence, your. Uh, the, 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 yes, okay. okay. You know what it is. It is a drider. Right. The there fuck are, is a dr you, while you've never seen <laughs> one, there are myths that driders are some of the nastier things in the Underdark. They are a sick um, chimera, basically, of ancient drow and spiders. Right. Any, like, weaknesses of the thing? Can I, like... <laughs> uh, it's mortal... Okay, I can kill it. That's good. Yes. I have the technology. You have <laughs> more technology. <laughs> you have the technology. Well, uh... Magic is not technology! <laughs> <laughs> in, in my mind, it is. Well... <laughs> so... <laughs> Listen, you're fucking derailing me. <laughs> <laughs> Well, none of these enemies are nearby because we aggroed stickling. So uh, what uh, Jarek is going to do is uh, get a hand on one of his throwing daggers. And, uh, well, what most likely target is actually... Uh, let's see here. No. Okay. Maybe I don't have to. Creep up right there behind Pearson. I don't want to be in the doorway, though. And uh, looks like you are an eligible target for Chant of Endings, my friend. All right. All right. Oh, yeah. All right, that's going to hit for 20 damage. Nicely done. Okay. Don't suppose it's a 10 or less, is it? Now? Not quite, no. It staggers, uh, but not a 10 or less. All right, that'll be the end of my turn, then. I'll save the throwing knives for oh, shit. All right, Keen. No, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, Keen. No. No, it's my turn. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Um, I'm going to move over to here so I can try and be closer. Am I in range? For yeah, a bow shot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're only three okay. away. Okay. Let's try and hit this bitch in the face. I'm going to aim. Use my quick action. 
for a head. I am going to re-roll that using my gauntlets. Okay. Well done. Um, so, 14 for nope. Stacey. Ah. Uh, so, five missed damage. No, that's not five. It is three, oh, seven you, you missed damage. You didn't concentrate? Oh, I seven didn't concentrate. Damage. It's seven missed damage. Oh. Okay, what, what, yeah. what is it that changed? Because it used to be five. So what changed? It, Just so I know. it used to be six, but with my incremental advance, I upped my dex so that ah. it would be plus four. Sh so it's now me. seven. <laughs> I didn't know you did that. All right, uh, I did. I told did you? you that. Did I you? gave you my Oh, my you did. You did. My mistake. No, no, no. You told me you upped your, your attributes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never mind. Yeah. I apologize. Ooh, yeah, right, yeah, so she yeah. takes seven damage. All right, she Ooh, takes yeah. seven damage. Cole, it's Ooh, your turn. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I would also like to know if I'm in range of lady pants over there. Yeah, you're 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 like thirty feet in the air, and so yes, you're definitely within right. range. I'm gonna see what my good old gauntlets is gonna give me. Oh Roll man. fifteen. I got a rock. Hang on, I've got the list here. Where's your list? Son of a bitch, where's your list? <laughs> I had it. I had it right here. I'm so organized. The bestest. <laughs> I'm so easy. I'm so Hold on. So so <laughs> I like to think of like, I'm so organized. You hear it go further, further away. The door closing. <laughs> him running down the stairs. A car starting up. He, talk, he talks away. to the puppy. <laughs> <laughs> Yoshi, no. Uh, back three hours later. I got it. In your arms. Uh, appears a wooden barrel that feels like it's feels like it's full of something. <gasps> feels like it's full of something. Mm -hmm. Well, whatever it is, it's gonna be thrown out a <laughs> big old spider. Yeah. <laughs> it's, like, it's like a barrel full of healing potion. <laughs> <laughs> Still going after Spider. Hold on, know what the fuck it is. He's still going to Wouldn't that be some shit? It's actually going to be like fair. I'm going to throw it at the one that just chucked lightning at everybody. All right. That is going to be... I think that would be a physical defense, given what it is. That is going to be a hit, just barely, oh, for wow. physical defense. So, um... Go ahead and roll damage for a large item, and then I will tell you the effect after. Oh, that man, is. Oh, really oh, okay. So thirteen. Yeah. So thirteen damage. It takes thirteen damage, and the barrel hits it, and the barrel explodes and covers <gasps> it with a black sort of ink, and it, it gets all over and in its eyes, and she screams in rage and anger. And for the next uh, turn, she is going to be a minus four to attack, basically dazed. Oh, good. Um, she probably won't see this one coming, then. I'm going to throw a javelin at her. <laughs> <laughs> You're so sassy. I love you. <laughs> All right, 18 more damage. Nice. <laughs> she probably won't see this one coming. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Coming. That and they can also probably track my sound. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. okay, uh, it's now the spider's turn. Unless, Cole, do you have any other actions? Um, uh, you have my movement action to steady myself on top of this freaking helmet. Alright. Because <laughs> it may or may not be tilted. Alright. So, it is now the spider's turn, and uh, the little spiders are not tall enough to reach anyone but Pearson. So, this one's going to come Sweet. here. Come to me, tiny spiders. Sit there and kind of like oh, try and oh, get yeah. over each other. And... Die one at a time. You know what sucks about spiders? Hmm? They a don't... lot of things. Well, that, <laughs> but they don't have exoskeleton. I mean, they have exoskeletons. They don't have bones, so I can't be a bone splitter on them. It sucks. Mm -hmm. And these two big ones are actually going to go for Keen and uh, Finn because they are tall enough to hit them. Oh, joy. Uh, awesome. So... We're going to you do You can hear Keen up there right now. Yeah. The small great. one first. <laughs> it's fucking fantastic. The small one first is going for Pearson. That is a 17. Hit or miss? Uh, uh, no, that's a miss. Oh, All wait, right. no, it's a tie. You don't go tie to defenders. You go die to... Yeah, so that's a hit. All right, then so eight seven damage. damage. 
eight damage. Eight. But no. Yeah, they they've always done eight. They just don't do any ongoing no, damage. Eight damage. Okay. Okay. Eight damage. Eight damage. All right. So big spiders. Big spiders. What are the big <clears throat> spiders going to do? <laughs> <laughs> nothing, nothing at all, Squee. They're the, um, not here. I'm gonna sleep. You know what? I'm they going lose to, the will uh, to live. I'm <laughs> going to do a little, a little give and a little good take. So the one that's attacking um, Keen is yeah. going to try to actually web up Keen and Pearson. Fucking awesome. <laughs> so <laughs> this is versus your physical Speak defense. For yourself. Versus your physical defense. That's 24 versus your physical yeah, defense. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Yep. Um, hang on. Uh, is that a... No, not not quite an 18. All right. So you guys are take three damage, and you're dazed until the end of the spider's next turn. Yep. Okay. All right. And Finn, this one's just going to attack you. There 10. That's not a hit. All right. You, it, doesn't, it doesn't quite get two to you. All right. That's the spider's turns. Uh, it is now... Well, well, escalation die time. All right, I think that's escalation of one. Mm -hmm. ba -da, ba -da, ba -da. It's the Drider's turn. She's probably not pissed or anything. She's a little. Yeah, she's, she's definitely really pissed. She's a, she's a tad pissed. That isn't even her final form. <laughs> she has a final form. Oh God. She goes. If it's a giant monkey, I'm getting the fuck out of here. She is going to point at Pearson and throw another bolt of lightning. Right. Why? Good, good thing that's not targeted at Cole. Wait, wait, wait! Will that go through the spiders? Um, no. Yeah, it, it, it doesn't. There's nothing in the book that says that she has to target around things, and the spiders. Yeah, I, I don't see why it wouldn't. It, let's just say if a critical misses, it will probably yeah, hit we can the do spiders. That way. You know, you know what? I'll yeah. even say this: if it misses you completely, okay. that just like you throw in the the fire thing, if it misses your physical defense, we'll see if it hits a spider. Okay. I think oh, that's yeah. fair. It, it's great. Pearson just stood there and did nothing but hold up his fist, and you know, Cole was the asshole. This is the last time I'm calling her ugly. This is the problem. I know it's the personal insult. Oh, God damn. I was even going to point out the <sighs> negative freaking four, but I don't think that really yeah. counts, does no, it? No. At right. least it's not oh, even. Uh, twenty. 20? Just twenty. Yeah. At least yeah. All again, right. at least it's not I'm even. Staggered. And that's her. Uh, that's her. Attack. Jesus Christ. Christ. All right. Uh, Pearson, your turn. Standard turn to use a recovery. All right. I'll roll it. That's my turn. All right. Okay. 14. Not staggered anymore. All right. Finn. I'm going to attack the spider in front of me. Okay. With my arrow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Takai. Oh! That, you son of a fucking bitch! Oh. <laughs> Holy oh. shit! Congratulations. Oh. Okay, that's, uh, uh sorry. That's 38 points of damage, I believe. Yeah. Yes. All yeah. Right. 38. It's Christmas. It is Christmas. staggered. You hit it hard. That's All right. Great. Anything else? No. Shit, my pants. Next turn. Uh, Jared! Well, that goes without saying. All right. a a as a warning, I can't target that drider with anything, because that's in my far away range, folks. So right. I can handle these things, and I, I'd have to go out the hell. So you folks who can actually shoot things far away. Uh, standard action is actually going to be to cast a spell that uh, Jarek has not cast uh, before, and this is actually going to be Ooh. against this uh, uninjured giant spider on his left to prolong right. the spell. This is Wave of Decay. Choose a nearby enemy. It takes 2d6 negative energy damage for each point on the escalation die. This is an auto-hit effect. Until the end of the battle is a free action at the start of each of your turns. Repeat this effect, as in I can choose another enemy who will take as many damage, much damage. So when the escalation dies, when the escalation is 2, an enemy would take 46. When the escalation is 3, 66. The effect continues yeah. until an enemy dies due to wave of decay, or I go down. So that giant spider, for instance, has a low roll. It'll take three points of damage. But on my next turn, as a free action, I can have wave decay targeted again, and it'll take 46 damage. Yeah, and, and then 66, and 86, and then 10d6 up to a max of 12d6. Nice. Yep. Okay. Until, I, until I kill something with wave of effect, or... Yeah. Anyway, that's my standard action. Unless this giant spider on the right is at 10 or less... 
No, no. It's staggered, but it's so. not quite that far. All right, I'm done. Other than a chastisement of, I can't reach that thing. <laughs> <laughs> or, or, uh, that'll be the end of my turn. All right. So it is All right. King's turn. Yeah, I have a question. Will I provoke an opportunity attack from the big, huge spider that's right in front of me? If I attack the drider? Uh, I'm going to say no, because it can reach to attack oh. you, but it kind of has to Lots. like try and get you through the window. So I would say that if you stand a little bit back, um, while it would still be able to attack you in its turn, I'd say that's kind of a... Um, a no man's land does that mean you know what i mean a gray area yeah i i will yeah. say no I, I you can shoot an arrow at something else and it won't be able to attack you but it can still attack you as long as you're on that platform just no attacks of yeah. opportunity that's fine i'll just try and attack with my bow again okay. aiming of course minus three 14 versus ac is not, not gonna cut it i'm going to try and save I do save, so I'm no longer dazed. Nice. Uh, and I am... You're Well, no, you're dazed until the end of the spider's next turn. There's no save. Yeah, it, it, there's no save oh. for that. Yeah. Well, then so ignore much. that other rule. Mm. Right. Okay. Um, All right. You're dead to me, done. roll. <laughs> yeah. All right. I'm going to eat uh, Cole, it's your <laughs> turn. Um, um, um. Um, am I high enough to grab a stalagmite? No, sorry, that's a stalactite. Excuse me. Yes, give me a second. Um, <laughs> uh, there's only medium-sized stalactites around you, though. Fuck those. <laughs> <laughs> I got javelins to throw. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. They're all aerodynamic. Wow. Uh, who are you throwing it at, by the way? <clears throat> oh, the, this dude, always. Okay. Forevermore uh, until something big changes. <laughs> Forevermore. <laughs> you hit it. Forevermore. Um, and that's 15 damage to it. Nice. Right. That's right. That's right, guys. Remember, not all the spiders came over here. We were only told to, that some of them were investigating, so wait until yeah. the rest of them slowly approach across the massive cavern. Okay. Oh, uh, and don't don't forget she also took seven miss damage from me. Yeah, I already I already got that one. Okay. I did. Excellent. I remembered. All right, um, so the spiders are going to attack. Um, the only small one that can is going to attack at Pearson. The others are just kind of like, flash, flash. No, no flash. Bad. That's going to be... Eight more hit. points of damage, yep. And that is going to be... Poison. Four ongoing. Do I take it right now or do I take it at the start? My no, no, turn? you start, start next turn. Okay, cool. Uh, and then the big spiders, one's going to attack Finn, one's going to attack uh, Keen. Now, um, the f one that attacked Finn is actually going to try and web Finn because they did not do that last time. So, this is versus your physical defense, Finn. Okay. That, I don't no. think that hits. Nope. <laughs> All right. Well, then, no, you're good. Spider it did nothing sucks. To you. The other spider is going to try and Little bite gags. Keen. Yep. Fifteen. Versus AC. Yep. No. No, doesn't get it. All right, that's the spider's turn. Yay! Escalation of dose. All right. Drider's turn. Drider is going to. Uh, walk back and forth a little bit, pointing and screaming, Get them! That's going to be the Drider's whole turn. Pearson. Drider only has one ranged attack, and she can't use it all the time. So, Pearson. Yay! Ha ha, you have a recharge. Neener, neener. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. You're, you wouldn't be so brave if I wasn't in front of you. Uh, so... Um, I guess I'll just start my form, my jab attack, uh, punching, uh, giving a sharp punch to the spider in front of me. Uh, I guess I'm no longer dazed. That's, that's good. No, you're no longer dazed. That's good. All right, so it's a plus eight. I get an 18. That is enough um, to hit the spider. Oh, nice. All right. Roll 3d6 plus three. Well, got to put a roll in front of that inferno. Hey Eleven. All right. It, it you you hit it really hard. It's, it's wobbling. Back. 
bad. So, oh, but you hit good. good. Oh, well, oh, it doesn't really matter if it was staggered or not. Okay, that's my turn. I'm not going to move, and I think Pierce is going to get big hit, keep his big dumb trap shut. So, all right, <laughs> that's my turn. All right, and it is Finn's turn. All right, Finn's then going to attack the the spider person in the back there, the drider. All right, thing. I think you almost have this giant spider that's in front of you killed with that one shot you did stagger and. Yeah, I'm gonna attack the drider uh, in okay. back there. <laughs> uh, let's see, Finn's not smart. Minus one. Uh, well, sure. That's that's why I was noting Fuck. like the spider in front. Of you. That's <laughs> not a hit. <laughs> it wouldn't have hit the big spider either. So you're good. No, it wouldn't have. But no. that is uh, three points of damage. All right. Anything else? No. Jarek, it's your turn. Okay, free action. I'm going to keep the wave of decay on this uh, this giant spider when else is ignoring so that I can continue to prolong it. Uh, that's going to be 14 points of negative energy damage on that giant spider nice. there on the left. Uh, as a standard action, uh, Drider's still not within my range, but uh, let's see what I can do here. Um, need the escalation die to go up one more, and then the fun really begins. Uh, Standard action for me will end up being using a standard action. Does, can this reach far away? No, I need a feat for that. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and cast... This one's been, not been used for a while. Unholy Blast. And I'm going to do this on the... Uh, well, I suppose I won't be killing it with Wave of Decay. I'll do it on the, the giant spider at the right. The one that's been heavily right. injured. Assuming I can actually attack through the translucent helm, is that... Yeah, uh, can, I, can I cast spells at it? Yeah, just, you know what? This, that spider is big enough that you could just look up and th cast a spell through Finn's window if you needed to. All right. Uh, There's an unholy blast on that one to the right. That's a critical for 34 oh, wow. points of Ooh. negative energy damage on that nice giant spider there at the right. That uh, was nice knowing you. So okay. Finn just sees a blast of magic go past her. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, the spider who's here at the front, who's attacking Pearson, is it at 10 or less? It really wants to kneel. Okay. Uh, <laughs> let's see. I don't know. I suppose this one should go to Keen. Uh, I'll go ahead and use death now on that one at the front. Eight hit points right. for Keen. Nice. Sweet. Uh, that will be the end of Jarek's turn. All right. Uh, Keen. Okay. I'm going to keep plinking this drider bitch. Alrighty. With my bows and arrows and Dry stuff. Dry bitch. Dry Dry bitch. Dry bitch. <laughs> <laughs> that is a okay. hit. Nice. Wow. For 30, damn. for 30 damage. Nice. Oh. Very good. Hooray! Woo! Woo! All right. And <laughs> that is my turn. It is staggered. Woo! 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 Cool. Ooh, wait a second. Your turn. Oh boy. Well, I'm going to follow suit and throw some javelins. If only. <laughs> if only. Ah, uh, that's not a hit. So it takes three miss damage. <laughs> and, and my eternal regret. <laughs> <laughs> Aww. All right, it's the spider's turn. These spiders, this one's going to come up to attack Cole, and these other two, frustrated by... Oh, that's... Um, Cool. Can, is it climbing? Not cool. Sorry. Sorry. Not uh, Pearson. <laughs> but these other two are actually going to climb the walls and oh boy. Uh, then hop up on here with Cole. Oh, joy. I got friends. You got <laughs> friends. DM forgot that spiders can climb walls. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they I was wondering about that. Well, well you know, maybe the spiders weren't that intelligent. They didn't realize. Why don't we go around? Yeah. The drider's like, go up there, you fools. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All so, right. Um, we can go there. That's actually why I was taking the roof. I was like, if anybody's going to be freaking doing a, a brawler, I'm going to do this. It, it is, <laughs> it is, it is, in my defense, it is the first battle I've run with creatures that can do such a thing. So um, we've got the small one attacking Pearson. Actually, you know what? I'm going to move this dead guy out a little bit so we can keep track um that's gonna be a miss I believe. yes yes the oh, two yeah. attacking coal first one miss second one that's gonna be a hit mm -hmm. plus so that's eight damage plus five ongoing all right eight damage which would be okay right. and uh the remaining big spider is going to try and take a bite out of 
Uh, crime? <laughs> crime? <laughs> I hope it's crime. Out of keen. Oh, that's a hit. That is going Fantastic. to be uh, 10 damage and 5 ongoing. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Are there no other spiders approaching, Squame? No, there are no other spiders approaching. Oh, I guess whenever they said, let's go investigate, it was, let's all go together and investigate. Okay. They're a team unit. They believe yeah. in oh, Ohana. More yeah, like so they, they, they believe Ohana in group. overwhelming force. You should have seen what it was if it had actually been like a kitten or something. Oh, yeah, yeah, really overwhelming. Oh, well, okay. All right. Um, now it is escalation of three. Perfect. It is Dryder's turn. Dryder is going to point at Cole this time oh. and uh, cast a lightning bolt. Yes. Better not miss because there's two spiders right next to me. <laughs> oh it's my fine. god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yes! Yes! Okay. Here's what I'm going to do. Uh, I am going to... There's two spiders next to you. I'm going to roll a d3. If it, if it rolls a 3, it hits nothing. If it rolls a 1, it hits the one to the hey, left of you. I will point out for players, if you roll a critical miss and two of your friendlies are engaged, or one of your friendlies, it hits them. 13 doesn't have a roll like that. Really? Because the, there was an ability I specifically picked to, no, no, to no, have no, that not no, happen. No, 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 no. The ability... Oh, no. Hang on. You might be right. Yeah, I think you're I you're think drawing my memory to that now. Yeah. Spell, of, spell attacks, okay. though. Okay. Yeah, that, that's to arrows. That's not to spells. Um, I'm still going to give it a... Hang on. Roll. D3. If it's a 1 or a 2, it hits one of those spiders. It's a 2. Hits the spider to your right for 20 damage. F you, spider to my right. Obviously, <laughs> it's not an even number. <laughs> and so it doesn't uh, cast another one. And it is Pearson's turn. Out of curiosity, I mm -hmm. might not be doing this right off the get-go, but if I wanted to move through the spider, like, do I have to make a special check, or does he just take an attack of opportunity? Attack of opportunity. Or is he just my way? That's okay, it, all right. That's good to know. That's good to know. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to take my four points of ongoing damage. All right. And then I'm going to continue my form, and now just following up, I guess, well, my previous punch. There's a new spider, but now it's going to be elbow that slams onto its uh, face. And I'm ass is it staggered? No, it's probably just fine as far as damage goes, right? Uh, the spider in front of me. Hang on. No, it's just fine. Okay. I do. I hit it for 26. Yeah, that's definitely a hit. Okay. And I do, so since it's a hit, I do 10 damage to it, and I'm going to use my form's special ability. On a hit, I can either take plus 4 to physical defense or move action as a free action, and therefore do kind of like a move and then another move to get to her. And I'll take the attack of opportunity. All right. So, hang on one second. That is a hit, but I don't think it's poison. So, uh, no, just eight. Is that 18 a hit? Okay. Let's see. I have a plus two to my AC because I'm in my second wave of my form, but that just makes it an 18. So, so yeah. You yeah. get eight points of damage. Okay. I'm staggered. This might be a horrible idea, but I don't care. No. And I did roll. I rolled the wrong thing, but a natural twenty means that it's really I rolled a six, so I did not get rid of that poison. I'm done. All right, uh, Finn. <clears throat> Gear mode activated. Moving in front of Jarek here. Oh, yeah. Just hopping no. down. Got him here. Yeah. Well, good yeah. thing two people can go through the door. That way, I can just bulldoze past you. Yeah. Correct. Wait, yeah. what? Oh. I, I'm sorry. leaving. Oh. I'm leaving this time. <laughs> hero mode. Hero mode activate. Push out of the way. Deactivate hero mode. Boom. <laughs> right. Let's see. And then 10. Doop. Uh, that's going to be a miss. Okay, but I get to do it. Do I, did I yes, you do. accidentally you do do it. roll it? No, I, I Okay. Boop. That is a critical. Um, not only do you add 17, but remember you have Blades of Abandon your first time you attack with them. 
uh, adds. Oh. You know what? It doesn't even matter. It's dead. I mean, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's good. It's, I don't have to worry about you, it then you, either. I guess good you, job. Hero I guess you mode. jumped down Hero onto it. And, activated. Yeah. Just drove it into the ground with your blades. Well done. All right, All right. Jarek. This ends now. Jarek will um, take his move action, go ahead and uh, position myself. I want to make sure that I'm just right in range of everyone. Let's go ahead and pull that back a little bit. Good. Make sure that I'm nearby. I'll go ahead and use the aura for this. I invoke the crimson wind of Shadowhold. And uh, Jarek, and this actually will end up targeting everyone on the board. Uh, Jarek is going... Well, first, I should roll my uh, my 66 damage for a wave of decay right. on the giant spider. Let's go ahead and take care of that. That's 19 points of damage on the giant spider. That's right. there. And now, yeah, uh, Jarek is going to cast Circle of Death. Special cannot be cast unless oh. Escalation is three or above. It's now three. This will target each nearby creature, including enemies and allies. I oh. will make an attack roll for every person. I'll start with enemies and go with allies. If it hits an enemy, it's 42 negative energy damage. If it hits an ally, it's 5 negative energy. Missing an enemy, the enemy takes half, and if I miss an ally, I take half. We'll start with enemies. Uh, we'll start with uh, the drider up there at the top with the circle of death attack. That's a 23 versus physical defense. That is uh, a hit. That's 42 points of negative energy damage on the drider. Alright. Uh, hang on a second. So... Oh. All right. It takes it. It's, it you really hit it hard. All right. Next is the giant spider that's nearby. That's 28 versus physical defense. That's a hit. 42 negative energy damage. All right. Uh, next is the spider on Cole's left. That's that's yeah, a hit for that's, 42 that's, negative that's, energy damage. Right. And then next is the spider on Cole's right. That's 84 points oh, of negative fuck. energy there. <laughs> I think Jesus it's dead. Christ. Okay. Spoiler alert. Did you miss? Oh my God. <laughs> it's attacks against allies. First is against Pearson. That's 23 versus yeah. his physical defense. That's yeah. five negative energy damage on Pearson. We'll yeah. do uh, Finian next. That's 19 versus physical defense for five negative energy damage on Finian. Next is uh, 16 for against Keen's physical defense. I think it's a miss. That missed us. All right, Keen, I take I take half of that, round it down, so it'll be two points of damage on Jarek. I go ahead and save the token, and then against Cole, that's a miss. Yes. <laughs> uh, that means I take another two. So yes, is that uh, a nova of dark red energy? I gotta change the color circle. Burst forth from Jarek. The the spiders who are on top fighting Cole just fucking incinerating ashes of negative energy. As does the giant spider in front of Keen. And uh, all feel the wave of terror that is the crimson wind of Shadow Old. Entered. I'm going to roll a d20 to see if I'm not poisoned. I'm not poisoned. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wait. All right. Uh, it is now <laughs> Keen's turn, actually. No, I didn't take my turn yet. Yeah, oh, fuck. You're after Keen. Never you're, mind. You're that roll doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> I may or may not still be poisoned. You are. Oh, Anyways. Okay. <laughs> um, that was amazing. And yeah. I'm going to shoot this bitch in the face again. <laughs> Woo! Yay! Woo! Bitch face. Yeah. So, hold on. Escalation is now three. Boom! 27 versus AC. That is for the Drider. That's a hit. Yeah. 21 and damage. And she is now blinded. Indeed. 21 damage. Indeed. All right. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. And I have to save versus this poison. You can do it. I cannot. Nope. And that is my turn. All right. Cole, it is your turn. Oh, boy! I'm going to use my train stunt to slide down the front of this, jolt off, uh, get a stalactite, and basically swing over and hit all the way next to this lady. Hello. <laughs> Would you like a hug? <laughs> uh, that's 65 feet. Even with your terrain stunt, that would be your entire action. Really? Yeah, because you're using your terrain stunt to jump 30 feet down. 
And I'm not going to have you jump 30 feet down and then rush 60 feet and still be able to attack. Normally, if you didn't use mm. your terrain stunt, you'd have to roll a die just to make sure you hit the ground and don't hurt yourself. Because that's 30 feet. That seems fair to me. Yeah. All right. Uh, then I would, I would, where, where would I land then uh, if I didn't take an extra movement or something? Uh, like right around, uh, right around the, the base of it. So like right around, you, you know, if you I take a leap, you can bottom. stay up to about there. Uh, you, if you take a uh, leap down. Yeah. Hmm. That would be more. All right. <laughs> then well, I will that's just, a, that's a that. 34 foot leap, man. That's pretty far. <laughs> I can't no damage taken. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. Um, I'm going to to do uh, just throw some javelins, I suppose. All right. Uh, okay. And that would be that would be a, a hit two. for 14 points of damage. And a secondary javelin will be flying through the air. Yay! Damn. All right. You that last one got it. Woo! Nice. Woo! Good. Which, uh, which, which I, I want to point out, it's a very, very good thing because uh, if it had attacked Pearson and hit, Pearson would be down. So, How do you know? Uh, if it hit you? <laughs> You know? Because I can math. How do you know how many hit points I have? <laughs> I'm the gun god. I know how many hit points you have. Okay. What? Okay. I'm teasing. Okay. I know. Yeah. <laughs> I would have made it if Jarek's uh, area of attack didn't uh, hit me. You don't I know. Have had just damage. Damage. Might have. Really attack? Yeah. <laughs> Could have been like sixty damage, and you know, I, I ain't gonna fucking limp away from that. Whatever. <laughs> But uh, no, you, yeah, that last that last javelin Ignor got it good. Yeah, yeah, great job, great job, Cole. I'm just gonna say, ignorance is bliss. Pearson mm -hmm. will just realize that nothing bad happened except yeah. he's beaten to shit right now. But whatever. Yeah. Speaking of being beaten to shit, can is the encounter over? Yes, the encounter is over. Okay. Yeah, I'm rolling. I'm rolling the recoveries until I can feel feelings again. Helm vanishes. Well, the effect. Ooh, yeah. 20. I'll do a recovery. And, uh, like and uh, mm -hmm. you guys are just uh, proving to me more and more that I can't ah. even look to the book when it comes to suggested encounter strengths. I just got to throw that out the window. Every Dude, single fight you guys have had tonight has okay. been higher than the suggested encounter rate. <laughs> you guys have been kicking ass. Squee? Look, mm -hmm. that would have been bad if those things yeah. hit more. Yeah. I understand. And look, look, we only fought three of the recommended four encounters. Yep. And, and I'll put it to you this way. This is the first time that I've actually had to use more than one um, actual recovery. Mm -hmm. I'm down to three recoveries left. I know. That, you, <laughs> so. you're, you're acting like that's a bad thing. That's, that, that means you guys play extremely well. Most people that play this game use recoveries all the time. What I'm saying is, yes, this battle seemed really fierce. It really did. But the fact that you guys have gotten so far and no one's even dropped to zero hit points yet is amazing. Mm. Listen, yes. except for my gloves of mind rot, I have used every single daily I have at my disposal. <laughs> now, don't, don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I am not. Don't get me wrong. I am not suggesting this was too easy. I, I liked it. I'm saying that if I had gone by what the book suggested to throw at you guys, you would have trashed it because you're that good. You know like, how to play mm. the game. That that spider lady was almost a guaranteed twenty damage to one person and a good fifty percent chance to do it to another, mm -hmm. including with a five percent chance to pretty much knock down whoever it hits. That drider was hey, a level six. As a, as a fair note, that book does not take into account the mix mishmash of talents that you right. have allowed us to blend in. Uh, Keen's extra damage that he deals, Cole's ability to throw things. The book has no concept of what that is. You know, it doesn't prepare for that. So the suggested encounter strength might also only be for four people as well, not five. No, uh, the suggested encounter strength is per person. Okay. The, the way the table works is, is, is it works the more people you have. But the point is, the point I'm making is, it's a compliment. You guys are really good at this. It's, yeah. Congrats. <laughs> it's okay. a challenge and we kicked its ass. Yeah, exactly. Yay. Well done indeed. Uh, that Drider was a level six creature. You guys were level three and were fighting more in boot. That's, that's really yeah. good. I so. felt the level six. Yes. Trust yeah. me. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, um, combat's over. What do you guys want to do? I'm gonna heal myself a bit. 
I'm gonna see if my item recharges. Yeah, just, me just too. Really Jeez. All right. Oh God, Jesus, me too. Fuck yes. no! God damn it! <laughs> Wait, both no. of them are just like. Mm. Oh, I never checked for my oh, wand either. Let me do that. Nope, wand doesn't recharge. Whatever. Uh, Still have the gloves roll, of mind rot. I'm gonna roll a d8 because I'm alone in this. Yeah, I got a six. <laughs> <laughs> you rolled the loser of all dice. No, actually, the d12 is the loser of all dice. Wow. The, Damn it. The, the D4 maybe is I, the loser of all dice. Maybe I yeah, accept it true. for who it is, Inferno. <laughs> maybe. All right, well, once... Uh, Kelmer's just going to tend to his own wounds as well. And then <laughs> there's a giant bonfire with, like, wrapped-up gnomes, I'm assuming. Yes, still. yes, we yes should there probably are. probably help them. <laughs> yeah. Jared's in no rush. All right, well... I am, after oh, I please. feel rejuvenated... I'm going to um, uh, probably blindly rush forward to help out. Jarek will reignite the torch that he extinguished before we engage this thing and continue to just keep watch. You know, there might be more spiders. Like, look at the ceiling, look around, who knows what else might be attracted. Right, uh, actually, as Finn approaches the giant bonfire, when you get close enough within about... Uh, how close are you? Yeah, yeah, within about 20 feet... Um, the giant bonfire starts to swirl and starts to grow Ooh. higher and it starts to take the shape of a giant kind of what you fought. Um, it has the lower body of a spider. It's all built out of flame. The lower body of a spider, upper body of a female, but the face is incredibly ugly and it is a face that Keen... And Jarek, if you can see it, would certainly recognize. <laughs> no, I, I could definitely see that all the way over to this. <laughs> That's part of why Jarek stayed as far <laughs> away from there as possible. Jarek's gonna tilt and go, "Yep," <laughs> just keep like looking. Like <laughs> the, uh, the 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 flame oh, is yes. gonna look around and then it's gonna see Keen and center on Keen and point a finger and say, "You, I know you." Oh. And now you come into my domain. You insult my children, murder my children. You will not leave oh the God. Underdark alive. I swear it. And with that, the fire just roars even higher and then dissipates to its normal size. Oh. Fantastic. Keen? Keen? You, you care to explain? Jared just, like, looks south and east down the... Oh, oh, yeah. Um, remember that thing that Seafeed was praying to? You know, the mo he, he's going to use air quotes. The mother. Well, that was um. That was the mother. Yep. Uh, remember that? Uh, oh, I probably didn't tell you guys. Um, back when we got that that belt, um, there was an orb. Uh, that. Um, Jarek and I looked at, and... No, it we of... definitely had this discussion with Lady Selene. Jarek will call out his back, <laughs> still turn to the bar. <laughs> Whatever. I can picture Jarek, she didn't see my face, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know, on second thought, I probably should have. Like that lich at home, Jarek, didn't see my face, I hid in the cloak the first time, second time, turned away. Good. Yeah, it's right. on key. Yeah, hmm. it's totally on me. So, um, yeah, we're dealing with the mother now. Um, yeah. So what? We well, killed whatever. her followers and... Kind of in the same boat here. I'm going to yeah. be yeah. more focused on unwrapping gnome bundles. Yeah, yeah. during this, Gilmore yeah. would be taking out his dagger and trying to cut the little figures free. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. Not during um, the, the mother talking, but after the discussion of yeah. what the fuck she is. Oh, okay. Uh, you, you cut them free, it takes some time, but, you know, it's, it's spider webs, but you can get through them, and, uh, you, you, you cut the gnomes free, and the gnomes are groggy, but they're starting to recover from the low doses of venom that they received, um, and, uh, they, they, uh, start to kind of sit up, and the one piercing that you cut open, um, <laughs> looks a little taller and older than the others, and when you get him, he kind of sits up and he says, who... Who are you? We are strangers from above, but a friend of yours, or at least an acquaintance, led us to you. We were hoping for your assistance, but it looks like you needed our help a little bit more. He nods a little confused and dumbfounded and says, Acquaintance? 
Yeah, and then uh, Pearson will point towards Cole, who is unwrapping one of the gnome's compatriots. And we'll probably back to him, still unwrapping, we'll raise a single hand. <laughs> he will and look at Cole back. and then close his eyes for a moment and say, I remember tales of an orc that were friends with gnomes. Are you the orc of the forest? Yes. I have heard that you were a friend. I'm glad to see the tales were true. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, oh, go ahead. I'm going to ask him, I, I do not know the clan name because I don't think I've ever gotten it, but um, I was going to ask him if he knows where this particular clan is, the, the one I know well. Uh, clan, uh, clan Tosh. T-O-S-H. Tosh. He, uh, his face grows very sad, and he says, that was good clan. The mother wiped them out. She's grown bolder and more powerful of late. I fear it's only a matter of time before the rest of the clan succumb too. And then she looks, and then, I'm sorry, and then he looks around and says, uh, but where are my manners? My name is Jiggle. The clan elder of Clan Vin. <laughs> Jiggle? Jiggle. <laughs> yeah. uh, when you said what his name was, in my mind, I'm like, now I remembered why I fucking hate gnomes. <laughs> <laughs> and I was the opposite. I was like, it's gnomes. gnomes. I get to have fun names. <laughs> oh, I fucking I hate gnomes. Up. I'm so It's Vince. like ass all over again. <laughs> uh, anyways, Jiggle. Alright, Jiggle. It's actually Jigal, you know. Jigal. Jigal. No, it's not going to work. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, and he says, thank you, but what brings you down this far? Well, I have come to the usual trading post I frequent. Found that it has been trashed, and here we are. He nods, and he acts like he's about to say something, but back from the direction Jarek is, you hear a loud, high pitch ween, almost as if a cry of terror or anger or rage. And everyone hears it, and when Jigal hears that, he uh, looks up and he says, Oh no, more of them are coming. The mother mm -hmm. doesn't lie when she says she wants someone dead. Quickly, we must get out of here. I'm okay with that. Let's let's go on. Let's go. Yeah, we're not. Yeah, I'm down with that too. Even though I can't get my sweet, sweet spider venom, I don't care. I don't want to get eaten by spiders. All right, Squee. You said that it was taking them some time to cut open the webbing, right? Correct. So that would be enough time to expect the Drider's body for loot. Yes, it would. Terrible. Oh, I'm glad you're the most mercenary out of all of us. Mm -hmm. Look, well, you guys got those bodies covered. And then while they were cutting webbing and going through story and character progression, I'm doing the real progression and checking for loot. You find lots of stuff. Um, spider legs, spider hands, half-dead female. Spider bitch. Spider uh, bitch. The big ones it. had black go-go. Oh, Lucy no, I'm sorry. Steel. And you, you find, you find <laughs> a, uh, a, she was carrying a mace of black steel. All right, all right. Uh, do I know anything about like, is it like arcane lore? Like black steel mazes are the most finest magical implements known to me. Like, no, nothing like that. You can roll me a, a, a an intelligence and uh, your magic background check to see if you can determine if there's anything special about it. Okay. Uh, you feel absolutely no magical uh, effect on this mace whatsoever. Oh, it's right. just a sure. very it's it's incredibly well crafted and not just to look pretty but to be incredibly effective but it's nothing more than just a very fancy mace. Fantastic. I'm sure that'll sell for shekels later. Jerick will take that. You and your shekels. Money's a board man. You buy know. camel. Uh, uh, so the uh, uh, Jigal <laughs> and the other gnomes help you try and free the other uh, there's a, like I said around 20 We'll say uh, actually 18 total. Okay. And uh, once you get them all free, they're like, quick, we must we must leave. Yep, yep. yep. Gonna follow yep. the gnomes yep. who oh, know how to yeah. escape. Uh, yep, go. down with oh, it. Oh, yeah. The, the gnomes 
I, I don't have any tokens or anything from them, but the gnomes basically uh, come back to this wall right here. Oh, hang on. I got to get my my thing out. Um, this wall? Yeah. Yeah, over here, over here. And uh, they go to the wall and they do something to it. The, the leader does something to it. And the stone starts to fold in on itself, creating a doorway, almost as if the stone was uh, pliable or liquid. It just kind of folds back on itself, creating a passageway. And he ushers the gnomes and, and, and ushers you along into the passageway and say, we must hurry. And as, you, as, as people start to leave that, the noises are getting closer and closer. There are more spiders approaching me. Jared turns his head. Oh. <laughs> yeah. All right. Kelmore is lagging behind a little bit, bit to make sure Jared can see them and gestures for him to follow as hastily as he can Jared before also disappearing. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Nicole's right. going to try to make through all the Garagi gnomes good. <laughs> all right. Yeah. yeah. Um, so everyone gets through, and as it's closing, you see a veritable sea of spiders pouring into the cavern oh. after you as the door closes behind you with the first spider about 10 feet away. Oh, God. Awesome. That's and where circle. That was for That's where we're in this session. Okay. Okie dokie. Can, 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 as the door is closing and the other spider is just 10 feet away, can, can Pearson just give him the finger? <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Pearson. Move. That's, That's our Pearson. Yep. <laughs> That's our Calamar. All right. Um, uh, uh, Solar doesn't mean that it doesn't have to be the fact that there was a secret passage in the spider layer. Maybe it's just something gnomes know how to do. <gasps> oh, shit. They can move rocks. Well, yeah, you can move rocks that... too, but, you know, <laughs> just not quite yeah, as impressively. Just, just as a side note, mm. it's a good thing that Jarek is not meeting the freaking lone wolf character because lone wolf character would go freaking nuts if he saw somebody holding a black weapon <laughs> yeah he would <laughs> inferno you remember in lone wolf black weapons oh were, yeah yeah they're just the the epitome of evil it's like making a weapon out of shit who would yeah. want to wield one or butterfreeze oh, oh my freeze. <laughs> 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 